Okay, we're just getting comfy. Now, we're back to motorbikes today, and uh, my brother-in-law was here uh, a couple of weeks ago, oh, no, last week, and he very kindly brought um, a bike lift for me. It, <laughs> I think he regretted it because it was so blinking heavy getting him back in the back of his new car on his own. Anyway, I'm very much appreciated in bringing it because as things are with Brexit now, uh, if I'd uh, ordered it for England and had it delivered, I'd have had pay import duty, which would have been a fair amount, actually. It's a Sealy um, bike lift. And uh, we'll, we'll sh I can't remember the model, but you can look it up and I'm sure you'll tell which one it is. But uh, I looked at these things because um, as, as I am now, I couldn't wheel a bike up a ramp on my own. And it's all going to be on my own. And so um, the bike lift looked the obvious answer. So I ordered it, delivered it, got it delivered to Michael and he brought it when he came to stay for a few days. Um, I don't think he'll appreciate being called an old codger. I am, obviously, but he isn't that old. He's only just retiring. And uh, so, uh, but um, you'll have come across Michael in our stories in the past because, well, <laughs> you will. I won't say any more. It might be embarrassing for him. Anyway, I appreciated him bringing it and he gave me a hand to put it all together. And here we are assembling it without more ado. Weighs 320 kilos. Right. I mean, that must weigh 100, 200. Oh, yeah, so it does, yeah. 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 Does it tell you what to put where? Yeah. Well, it shows you a picture. It looks fairly straightforward. Yeah, it looks pretty straightforward. There aren't any more nuts and bolts. There other. There's no, there isn't. There's part of this. It doesn't need them, though. I think it's all. Careful, yeah, careful. Yeah, strange enough. Sometimes it gives me a twinge. Careful with it. Careful. I've obviously got old very quickly all of a sudden. <laughs> There's a knife. But you want to... Uh, yeah, yeah, just... Uh, okay, you, 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 oh, you do it. I can slice, cut yourself. Slice my own fingers. Yeah, 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 don't cut yourself. Yeah, I think you've both put some cardboard out. Oh, if you were throwing the bits... Um... Nuts and bolts away. Nuts and bolts and washes. That's a, that's a nice machine bit, that is. for your bigger spanners. Um, uh, they should be in the bottom of that. Yeah. Take the tray out, nothing in yeah, it. Yeah, no, they only go up to 22, this is a 24 now. Because uh, there might be another box somewhere, yeah. isn't there? Yeah. Uh, yes. So, <laughs> the question is, is you do not rush, you do check anything twice. Yes. So, 
the back, it had to be here, so we had to walk around the back then. So well, yeah. Mm. Now look at this. Not, not enough to metal with. Now look, look at, it's up. Now my God, we've done a bit of jiggling about, and we found that the uh, these clamps that come with the thing to fit on your bike frame, they don't fit this BMW because they uh, um, are too high up and things are in the way and uh, whatever, so they won't fit ours. So here, it's on the back stand and with a piece of wood under, under, under the sump at the front and it's, what, wait for it, it's really stable. I mean, it, it just doesn't budge, look at that. I'm pulling on the handlebars, it's, it's really stable and it's a hell of a good work height, that is. And it's substantial... And it's missed, uh, we were a bit concerned that the cylinder had to get in the way, but it's just gone behind that, look, and there's a gap behind the carburetor, so you could even take the carburetor off if you wanted, but it's up there, on this side. Um, and here's the gadget, as Michael says, there's a place to put the jack handle, there's a place to put the locking pin, which is in there, there's pin, secure pin, so there's no pressure on the jack now, uh, it's, the pressure's off, and that's holding it. And it's a really damn good bit of kit, that. I really recommend that. So there it sits, ready to do some work on it. Excellent. So, there we are. The bike lift is brilliant. I mean, in a word, it is fantastic. It was easy to put together. Uh, it lifts the bike up, no trouble at all. It's very, very stable. I, I, I would have to probably fasten it down if I was taking the wheels off because that would unbalance it a wee bit. But yeah, for working height and everything, it is not at full height yet. At working height, it's absolutely, for someone, you know, older, who doesn't want to get down on the hands and knees all the time, this is brilliant. So I can, I'll tell you more as we start doing some work on the bike. But anyway, thank you for watching. Remember, if you like it, please give us a like and um, think about subscribing to the channel. And then there's a link in a minute to show you about all our other publications. Remember, there's uh, 200 audio stories. You can download everything free of charge. Ten books, including picture story books and stories for kids. So lots of entertainment there. Thank you for being with us. Until the next time, cheerio. I've just clouded that microphone again. <laughs>